My name is Mike Ruma. I'm a maternal fetal medicine specialist. I work at Perinatal Associates in New Mexico. And what we're going to talk about today is the Epic and Affinity ultrasound platforms, the latest release of software, which incorporates a variety of new features. FlexView is a tool that allows for easy visualization of technically difficult anatomical views from 3D volumes that are essential for diagnosis of OBGYN pathology. It takes all of the complications out of NPR and the manipulation of a surface rendered volume. By either deploying a straight line or a curved trace or a continuous trace, we can take a curved image and flatten it out and make it a single planar image. We're gonna select flex view as this new feature. You can see a longitudinal or sagittal image of the uterus clearly able to see the myometrium of the uterus and the endometrium well. And we have a, a few different choices here for trace type, curve trace, straight line or continuous trace. We're gonna use straight line for this portion of this demonstration. We're gonna move from the fundus and deploy this straight line. And you're gonna see as we cut through the longitudinal image of the uterus that the IUD appears the endometrium appears and the myometrium also in a perfect coronal plane. As I select this, I can then move the imaging throughout the uterus, making perfect coronal images from this nice longitudinal selection. This FlexView feature incorporates a couple different selections that are available in these two rotary knobs. One of those is intensity projection, which can go from maximum, which you're seeing labeled here as one, or minimum. And as we migrate through to intensity projection, one, two, three, and four, you can see that the intensity projection from minimum here really accentuates soft tissues and things that are of low reflective capacity. And as we increase the intensity to average and a mix and then maximum intensity projection, features that have a higher reflective nature, clearly the IUD is much more easily visualized in this scenario. Watch what I can do here with FlexView. If I choose FlexView, I chose FlexView here with the 3D tab. I'm gonna use curve trace because the fetal spine is curved. I'm going to place this initial reference point here and we're going to slide this through and you're going to see that the sacrum is going to come into focus, the vertebral bodies are coming into focus, and the ribs. I'm going to place this right at the cervical spine and then I'm going to, since curve, place this other X right in the middle of the spinal column. You can see now on the right hand side, within seconds, we've achieved a single planar complete image of the spine from the cervical vertebrae, thoracic vertebrae, lumbar vertebrae down to the sacrum. We can see the wings of the pelvis. We can use volume here and apply a flex view volume, providing the user yet another way to image the ribs and the fetal spine from the cervical down to the sacral regions of the spine, giving us diagnostic confidence that, that fetal spine is within normal limits. Very easily achieved using a new tool, FlexView, available on the Philips Epic and Affinity systems.